I did not know about the elementary catechism on the Constitution of the United States when I was originally studying the document, yet I still find it helpful. Some of the questions forced me to examine my understanding of the Constitution and make sure I could justify my position. For example, one question is, who is to determine whether any law is contrary to the Constitution or not? The people themselves? No, but certain persons who they have appointed, called judges of the Supreme Court of the United States. This answer is only partially correct. No, the people themselves are not the arbiters of what is constitutional, but the justices of the Supreme Court have not been delegated that power either. But since the power is not prohibited by the Constitution of the states, they retain the power to determine if a law is contrary to the Constitution. People learn in different ways. Some prefer reading books while others watching videos. Some prefer more academic instruction while others like a more plain spoken approach. Whether you are a new student of the Constitution or a long time one, whether an attorney, judge, or just a plain everyday American citizen, I recommend spending some time with the elementary catechism on the Constitution of the United States. As the Supreme Law of the Land from Article 6, Clause 2, it is very useful to know what trumps the acts of our government, or as Mr. Stansbury put it, that a people living under a free government which they have themselves created should be well acquainted with the instrument which contains it need not be proved. We claim to be living under a free government. Should we not be well acquainted with the Constitution that created it?